So I have noticed a meme or a posting of some kind. I don't know if it's a meme, but anyway, the point is there's a posting around going on the internet. It's kind of blowing up right now. It has to do with the Deadpool movie. It's congratulations to Deadpool for being the first R-rated rated R comic book movie. And as you can see right there in the picture, it's a Blade, which is actually another R-rated comic book movie. So what exactly is this picture trying to imply? Like, what's the, what's the interpretation of this picture with the caption? Uh, for, it could be different for some people, but for me, it's, it's saying that um, Deadpool's not the first com R-rated comic book movie. Uh, Blade is the first R-rated comic book movie. But that is false. That is wrong. That is not true. To the best of my knowledge, all the Blade movies that I know of came out in either 1998, 2002, or 2004. However, there is another comic book movie that goes even further back, The Punisher. The very first Punisher, released in 1989. So, right off the bat, right there, the, this, this claim that Blade is the first rated R comic book movie is false. The question of the video I'm trying to give is, was Blade the first R-rated comic book movie? And so the answer simply is, no, it's not. In fact, there's another comic book movie that goes all the way back to 1973. Now, this comic book movie is not a DC or Marvel comic book movie, but it's still a comic, it's still based off a comic book regardless. The comic book movie I am referring to here is called The Vault of Horror. There was a movie adaptation back in 1973. Now, when I was first notified of this news, I decided to go look it up myself. And again, like to the person who notified me, uh, I didn't say that Pun The Punisher was the first comic book movie. I was saying it might be. I never implied that it was. I never said that. I was simply claiming that, it, that, that Blade was not the very first R-rated comic book movie. So yes, I looked it up. Now here's where things got tricky for, for at first. I typed in The Vault of Horror, and on Google, if you type it up, you might get this little pop-up on the right side where it says PG. It gives the rating of PG. So I'm like, wait a minute, what the heck? Like, you just told me, like, it's R-rated, but yet here's something else right here. So immediately, I didn't trust the Google search because I'm just thinking to myself, why would, he, why would someone just lie about that? It doesn't make any sense. So I did some more research and in-depth. And so I went onto sites like IMDb, and I found contradictory information on IMDb. Uh, one point it was saying it's PG, and then I was seeing an R-rated section where it was talking about parts in the film, why it got the R rating in the first place. Then I went to other, I typed, in, I typed into Google, the Vault of Horror R rating, or rated R. And they got different responses, including one that says that, there was, that it was recut. And I found this on an Amazon page for a double speech, double feature of The Vault of Horror and Tales from the Crypt. And so, yes, it turns out that The Vault of Horror, yes, it was originally released as an R-rated movie. However, someone or, or a group of people decided that it was a good idea to recut the film down to PG. Now, some people online are furious about this. You can see the reviews for, your, for yourself. I'll even, like, screenshot some of the reviews. Uh, there was even a letter, an e electronic letter, letter given to someone from Fox themselves, the distributors of the film. Vault of Horror was originally re released, re was originally released, excuse me, as an R-rated film, but was later recut to a, get a PG rating. This recut version is the only version owned by 20th Century Fox. When developing the DVD, we did research information about uncut, uncut print, which was released theatrically. But after several attempts, we were unsuccessful in, in securing a copy of that print. To satisfy the consumer demand for the title on DVD, we decided to move forward with the widescreen PG version we had in the vaults and included it with the Tales from the Crypt as part of the Midnight D Movies double feature series. This is interesting because, again, Blade is not the first comic book movie. Not only that, comic book I'm sorry, Blade is not the first R-rated comic book movie. Not only that, R-rated comic book movies have gone as far back as the 1970s. Unfortunately, though, someone decided it was a good idea to make a recut of it. And now there's no one, for some reason, can't seem to get a hold 
of uh, the R-rated version, for whatever reason that may be, to re-release it in, R in the R-rated version. Now, if you saw Vault of Horror in, as, as the uh, R-rated version, I'm pretty sure you would be very upset if you love the movie a lot to see that you can't get a copy of it on DVD. Um, for those of you who are fans and know that, I suggest you probably start like some kind of campaign to uh, whoever owns the whoever owns or holds the uh, property for the R-rated version of of uh, Tales, not Tales, um, the Vault of Horror. I had to go through some loopholes, for lack of better words to find out that in fact it was R-rated but it was later changed to PG through re-editing editing the film. The overall premise of this video was is was Blade Runner the original R-rated movie? The answer is still no it's not. Again, like I mentioned earlier, The Punisher, the original Punisher comic book movie adaptation from 1989 is R-rated. Regardless of whether you like it or not, it, it's, it's, it's still R-rated. And on top of that, there's other comic book movie adaptations that are rated R that go back to 19, the 1970s with The Vault of Horror, 1973 to be exact. Could there be a comic book movie that goes even further back? I don't know. That's a problem I had with the Blade photo, was that it was implying that Blade was the very first R-rated comic book movie, but that's simply just not true, and I have shown why it's not true. I'm also curious now, I'm curious now, are there other R-rated comic book movies from before Blade, like from an earlier part of the 90s, or uh, other comic book R-rated film adaptations in the, 80, in the 80s, or even the 1970s, or even further before The Vault of Horror? If any of you, le if any of you know that by any chance, comment in the, in the description of, uh, not in the description, comment in the video, comment on the video, let me know, because I'm curious to see what these other R-rated comic book movies are. I know that Sin City is a is an adaptation, is a graphic novel, novel slash comic book. There's an adaptation of that. It's a, a film noir, it's a noir comic book or graphic novel, I'm not even sure at this point. If anyone has any uh, comic book adaptation movies that are from the 90s, before Blade Runner, I mean, I just, I can't believe I just said that. Before Blade, and the 80s, and the 70s, just comment below and let me know. I, I'm curious to see if there are any. I'm sure, I'm sure there are. I just don't know any at this point. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video.